meet Senior Day. First off, I just want to say a little something about this whole group of seniors that we have graduated. They first met in kindergarten in Miss Miller's class at Carter Rock Springs. So all you folks in kindergarten now, look around you. You could be up here someday. They've been the best of friends for many, many years. They've been part of our kudos for as long as anybody can remember. They have been coached by Scott for almost as long as he's been here. And now, their coaches themselves are especially proud of all the young kudos that they've taught through the years, who now love the kudos as much as they do. The interesting thing when I got the bios for all four of these guys, uh, I noticed that three of the four actually picked colleges they don't really have mascots, they have a color, okay? <laughs> so, go figure, maybe it tells you a little bit something about. First we're gonna have, we're gonna go alphabetically by your last name, not your first name. First we're gonna have Jeannie Gathright. <laughs> Besides balloons, we also have a tiara. <laughs> <laughs> and something to help you swim really fast and then crash afterwards. <laughs> Jenny Gathright is actually a second generation CUDA and the youngest of three CUDA siblings. She's been sewing for Carter Rock since she was five years old. She started out as a swimmer and a diver. But hey, her mom just took one look at how close her head came to missing the diving board and said, you are banned from diving forever. <laughs> her favorite CUDA memory is winning the all-star relays as an eight and under with her fellow senior swimmers, Trisha and Grace. Jenny learned a lot from her time with the Kudas. She learned how to deal with disappointment, that hard work does pay off. She learned how to be a strong leader, gracious leader, loser, and a humble winner. Jenny also swam for the Sea Devils for 10 years, and she graduated from Holton Arms, where she was a varsity swimmer named MVP, or MBS, two years in a row, all ISL four years in a row, and was captain of the swim team. She'll be attending Harvard University in the fall. Go Crimson. Next up is Grace LeBoy. Grace joined the Kudas as an eight-year-old in 2002 because her friends Jenny and Trisha said, hey, this is really, really fun. <laughs> Eleven summers later, it's still a blast. That first season, Grace joined Trisha, Jenny, and Nina Harcher as part of the eight and under Thunder, winning the all-star relay. So technically the peak of her swim career at that time, the best part of Grace's good experience has been the wonderful friendships, team spirit, and camaraderie gained over so many summers of swimming. For the past three years, Grace has loved being a pre-team and mini kudos coach for the next generation of Carter Rock swimmers. When not swimming, Grace's true passion is music, and she has enjoyed singing the national anthem before many a home swim meet. Yay! Even is early in the morning. I, I think people have said they've actually seen her in her car um, practicing. <laughs> she is our, basically our star in the Star Spangled Banner. <laughs> Grace, Grace just graduated from Walt Whitman and is headed to California this fall. Will she be a music major? Um, and actually, at Walt Whitman, she actually made the halls come alive with the sound of music there. So much so that she is going to be majoring in studying opera and classical voice at Stanford University. Go Cardinal. The color. <laughs> Next up we have Trisha Sabrino. Yeah, Trish. Trish. Trisha joined the Carter Cudas as a five or six year old. Not quite sure on that exact date. She is the third in the Sabrina Cuda line, so her parents' memory is a little fuzzy on the exact year she became a Cuda. <laughs> Trisha has had many wonderful years as a Cuda swimmer. She also peaked at that eight and under Thunder Relay. <laughs> remember the breaststroke. And with Jenny, Nina, and Grace. Trishy, Trisha? Uh, Trishy the Fishy. Uh, she's affectionately known by her family and closest friends, now the rest of Carter Rock. Um, she's loved being a Kuda swimmer and coached the past 13 years. While no longer our little guppy, 
Patricia now teaches the next generation of car rock swimmers along with her best friends from her hard rock summers, Jenny, Sam, Brace, and Ani. This June, Patricia graduated from Holy Child, and come late August, she will head to St. Joseph University in Philadelphia to study elementary education. We can't wait to see where her next strokes take her. Go Hawks! All right, Patricia. Last but not least, we don't have a TR for Sam. Oh. But we do have 2012 <laughs> classes. <laughs> Sam Woodbury yes. has been a CUDA since he joined pre-team at the age of five. He swims just a little bit better now. Even then, he was one of the bigger cheerleaders for the CUDAs and their biggest fan. As he grew older, he competed harder and provided even more support for his teammates. Sam graduated from Walt Whitman High School and was a member of their swim and dive team, serving as team captain this past year, the most spirited team captain yet. And as a pre-team coach, he immediately established a bond with the youngest kudas, teaching them not only about swimming races, but also what it means to be part of a team. He has carried on that tradition as an assistant coach for the kudas. Sam will bring that kind of dedication focus and team spirit to the University of Michigan at the end of the summer. Go Big Blue. Go